scriptures. So you had the Mac the, uh, the Maccabees yeah. brothers, the, the mother. She actually understood the um, they, they knew about the resurrection even back then. She was confident, like I already know that I'm gonna be uh, resurrected, you know, unto, unto glory. But you not gonna be partaker of that glory. So hey, hey, we <laughs> whatever we go through on this side, man, we're gonna forget about it when we get in the kingdom. Because it's gonna be so, you know, <laughs> It's going to be so beautiful, man. Yep. Uh, Isaiah 64, 4. For since, for since the beginning of the world, men have not heard, nor perceived by the ear, neither have the eye seen, O Yahweh beside thee, what he hath prepared for him that waited for him. Yep. Hey, all we could do is just use you know, our imagination to think about it, but even then, falling short we don't know hey you you we ain't seen what like the scripture say you ain't seen with, with the physical the bodily eye you have not thought it in your mind you, you don't know how 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 growth how, how growth glorifying and how beautiful that the, the place that the lord prepared for us is going to be our thoughts are not his thoughts our simple minds can't possibly come up but what he, close to what he's, what he's got said. It's really, we were given descriptions of, a, of what yeah. it would look like, you know, as far as uh, the gates. But you got to think about, like, everything is going to be in its perfection, you know? Yeah. We, we really haven't even, even seen Even our eyes. Yeah. <laughs> hey, but all we, all we have is, is just our vision. Yeah. yeah. And, and, and it's like, even the, the, image, the images that you have in your head, as far as your vision, you still use those visions to keep you motivated yeah. and continue on the path, yeah. like, yeah. like 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 that movie Life, yeah. when uh, 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 Eddie Murphy he yeah. kept talking about the boom boom boom, yeah. but that was just a figment of his imagination. Yeah. But he was able to see it; he he was visualizing yeah. it, and that's what actually helped him to to to, to deal, to deal to with deal that sentence that, that he was going through. Yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah. he had his own in his own uh, uh, from his own perspective. You know, of, of what uh, Ray's boom 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 could be. And that was a dope scene that you brought that up now, because when you look at it scripturally like that, so he said, hey, so, so Ray, what's that, that boom 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 he was talking about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was over there last night. Yep. That's yeah. how we push these scriptures to you. We give you the visuals and the reality, because you, you used to read it from the old uh, Catholic priest, dry ass Catholic, Catholic priest, which is where but we we put this word this word in living in living form. But you can see the people, you can see how they look, you can, you can just like in that scene when they went into the club and they was all doing this. That, look at the chef and cooked up this steak. We got somebody on the keys and singing and they got all of that, and they were visualizing it like it was real. That's how we bring these scriptures to life. Tobit chapter 13, verse 16, and read down. For Jerusalem shall be built up with sapphires and emeralds and precious stones. And we even, because we have these uh, smartphones, and we're in the information age, we can Google what these stones look like. But, but still there, you know? Yeah. Because like, uh, for example, we haven't seen 100% gold, you know? Right. So the, everything that we do see is still corrupted, you know? Because look, Esau corrupts the earth, he corrupts the, the skies and all of that, so all of that plays a part. Yeah, these are uh, real stones that we have, but have we really seen them in, in a perfection? They've been, everything's you know? been tainted. Yeah, kind. You know, like what the brother said, our eyes, it's, we, our eyes gonna be, uh, gonna be better than this, man. It's so spiritual, it's like, our body, we had to actually change our bodies to go into the chariots, to go into the kingdom, because these bodies can't even fathom the power. God. You know. Yeah. Well, I, believe, I believe me and you was talking, we said, um, if we got um, if we got uh, into the kingdom with these bodies and ate a, ate some ate some food, we'd die, bro. Yeah, yeah, like yeah, if we yeah. ate some fruit, it'd be too too nutritious. The, these bodies can't go into outer space, you know, to other galaxies. You know, we, we, we got we, hard time concentrating these yeah. poor damn bodies. Right. <laughs> we need new bodies. Thy walls and towers and battlements with pure gold. And the streets of Jerusalem shall be paved with beryl and carbuncle and stones of Ophir, and all her streets shall say hallelujah and they and they praise him saying blessed be Yahweh which hath extolled it forever 
Right. Kind of like, man, it's like it's like really like you know like uh, the food magazines. That's that's what yeah. we do. Like you could you could look at a food magazine all you want to, you know. You can see it. You can be like, oh man, I, I've tried those ingredients before, but you ain't never smelled them ingredients. You know, you ain't you ain't never actually laid eyes on on the the the, the, the little uh, the heat that was coming for that food. You know, it's like the details, like. Got that. Just imagine the streets paved with gold. Look at this shit, man. This is concrete. Right there. Can you get that? That's concrete, man. Done. Just imagine that pure gold. Imagine how an hour's gonna feel on your on your feet, man. Hey, we ain't gonna build it. You heathens gonna build it. Kind, bro, kind. You heathens gonna pave the streets with gold. Kind. It's gonna be that vibration. You ain't even gonna walk. It's just all that glory is just gone. The whole vibration is gold. Yeah. You got something right there? Yeah. You got something too. It's uh, 1 Corinthians chapter 2, verse 9. Read down on 11, Bob. So we'll just talk about it. Read down on 11. It says, But as it is written, it, yeah. I have not seen nor ear heard, yeah. neither have entered into the heart of man the things which the Most High have prepared for them that love him. And that's, that's Isaiah 64. You know? yep. That's what I just read. But the Most High have revealed them unto us by His Spirit, for the Spirit search of all things, yea, the deep things of the Most High. But the deeper things, we have a glimpse into it. We can't, it says in uh, Corinthians uh, the 13th chapter, we see through a glass darkly, but then we'll see it uh, face to face. We'll see the, the, the truth of reality in, that, in, in actuality. We'll be able to see it later and really truly understand in that moment. But for now, we just kind of get a glimpse through the Spirit. Right? It says, for what man knoweth the things of a man, save the spirit of man which is in him. Yeah, all we know is what man upon earth can know. We can't know the things of the heavenly father. Go ahead. Even so, the things of the most side know of no man, uh -huh. but the spirit of the most side. That's right. But the spirit can only reveal it to us that on a level of, like it says in um, uh, Sirach the third chapter, uh, many are shown uh, to men that men do not understand. We, we're getting shown through the spirit a lot of things, but only uh, uh, because we're men upon the earth, we can only see so much of it and understand so much of it. But we still have more than we can perceive and, and, and hear more than, than the other people that don't, that wasn't given the spirit of understanding. I got another quick three. This is a uh, second, it's like a yeah, second Ezra chapter four. And verse, I'll start at verse 26, it says, Then answered he me and said, The more thou searcheth, the more thou shalt marvel. For the world hasteth fast to pass away, yeah. and cannot comprehend the things that are promised to the righteous in the time to come. Okay, let's speak for myself. Yeah, God. Let's speak for myself. Okay, break it down. For this world is full of unrighteousness and infirmities. That's the, that's the part you got to understand. Okay. This world is full of a hey, The fact that your eyes can't even, like, I can't even see the, the mountain right there. I can't even see the mountain because I got bad vision. We're not going to have bad vision in the kingdom of heaven. I'm going to, that's a goat over there eating off of uh, some leaves or something. I'm going to be able to see that. He said, look at that ant. Yeah, look at that ant doing, doing that, that you know, ant hill or whatever. We don't, the, the true glory of, of the bodies that we're going to get, man, is going to be, we can't even fathom that situation. These bodies in, this, in, our, in, our, in, our, in our minds in this state can't, can't even come close. But when we get it, you gotta believe that when we do finally get it, it's worth fighting for, because when we finally do get it, man, it is, it's gonna be more than what you've ever dreamed. And that's the reason why, going back to uh, Romans uh, 8 and 18. You bring yeah, that back I told again, you, bro. Uh, go back to it's Romans 8 and 18. Start at 16. So that's why whatever <laughs> hell we go through, it doesn't even fucking matter, man. Just look, look what we get ready to, to receive, man. It says that we, you can't even comprehend it. The human mind can't even comprehend what we're getting ready to receive, man. And that, and that gift is only for the nation of Israel. Right. Go back to uh, Romans 8 and 18. This is Romans. We, 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 I had it, I had it uh, earlier uh -huh. when you were talking about your house shot. Come on. That Come on. Chapter 8 and verse 16. The Spirit itself bear witness with thou spirit that we are the children That's the of the Most High. That's the Spirit that's showing us the divisions of these things from the Heavenly Father, but we can only perceive it as men perceive it. Right? And if children, then Harris. 
hairs of the Most High and joint hairs with Yahweh Shai. He, he got the glory and was able to see it, sitting on the right hand. We're gonna eventually, after we go, he got his trial, after he goes to hell, we gotta inherit that trial, and then we inherit the glory also. This is part of our trial. But then also a living sacrifice, like he made himself a living sacrifice. If so be that we suffer with them, that we, that we may also be glorified together. Yeah. That we may be glorified together. Hey, just like when we catch hell, Yahweh Shah is being glorified in our bodies. When we get persecuted for, for teaching his word, that's Yahweh Shah and the Most High being glorified in us. Because he told us, if, uh, the world uh, uh, cannot hate you, but me it hate you. Because the works thereof I testify of are, are evil. All right, if they if they hated me, then they would also hate you. Okay. You know. Go ahead. Verse 18. For I reckon that the sufferings of this present time are not worthy to be compared with the glory which shall be revealed in us. It can't be compared because. <laughs> You can't comprehend that that level of glory, man. I mean, bro, <laughs> the, the the thought of death will never cross our mind. Yeah. In this life, everybody anticipates when they're gonna uh, expire, man. Yeah. Everybody, man. Now yeah. I don't know when I'm gonna go. You scared to uh, say certain shit because you you you, you, you afraid of even you even things. afraid of thinking about that shit, man. Yeah. He's gonna bring in. Hey. What is say uh, our children gonna be playing the whole of asps, yeah, right. poisonous snakes, and then man, cockatrice dens, and they're playing with the animals, man, not afraid of nothing. Yeah, you know, but you just can't uh, imagine, man. Like there's no, you ain't, there's no death date for you. Yeah. You're gonna oh. live forever and ever. You know, you're gonna you're gonna live many generations, and you're gonna see your grandchildren with grandchildren with grandchildren. Man. And you still gonna look young, <laughs> you know? The stuff like that, man. I got the uh, first Corinthians chapter. You want me to keep reading? Or that was it. That was the point. You know? So just imagine you. All right. However, Esau takes one of us out. You know, we get beheaded. You know, we go up under the guillotine. All right. That's that's what 2.5 seconds. That's quick. Now, after that, eternal life. Yes. You, you'll, you'll never die again. Victory is swallowed, uh, death, is, death is swallowed up in victory. Yeah, death wears thy sting. You know? Now, now you now you get a, 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 a crown of glory, man. They just glory. You know? <laughs> now, now you got, now you get to uh, get slaves, servants. Now you get your own uh, 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 palace. Now you get to uh, ride your own chariot. Now you live. Now you get to really live. <laughs> Now you get to have as many wives as you want. Your, your riches are unlimited. You get to control and manipulate the elements, man. You get to fly, man. You get to, you can teleport. Telepathy speaks without Telepathy. And we were jumping the way over here. We were going to be flying. We were like, we going to be flying and talking to a bird. We going to be gods, man. And this yeah. is Esau's fantasy. This is why he <laughs> creates these uh, Marvel, yeah. you know, yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, Marvel, Capcom, mm -hmm. you know, Universe. stuff like that. Yeah, man. Yeah. This is Esau. What, the, the birthright is what Esau yeah. fantasizes about. Yeah. That's given to us. Everything you know? that Esau researches in, uh, in his technology, it's to try to be a god. Uh, yeah. Try to live. He wants forever. to be. He, that's, he, he, he thinks he. That's why he thinks he is the most high. Told him, they briefly said it when you go back to Genesis 27, but Isaac must have went into like more detail about what he actually gave. Yeah. He about, <laughs> about the blessing. <laughs> man. Yeah. Like I he didn't just say I made him Lord of all. You know, he didn't just tell him that he, man, he's gonna be able to he must have understood later like all that really comes with that. Yeah. Dude is hot. Yeah, man. It's like, me too, though. <laughs> so my kids got questions. <laughs> so he told me to ask. Um, he wants to know out of Levit Levitical law, can you eat ants and their larvae? No. Uh, that we were, we were there. He wanted to make sure, and being about being 
this is it is. When you go in there, it tells you about the type of different things you can eat. Yeah. Now, I believe it says the hind legs have to be taught in the body. So like, like uh, cricket. Crickets, cricket. uh, grasshoppers, grasshoppers, grasshoppers. locusts. Yeah. They have okay. a thick leg like that. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, those are like the meat or the protein that's in the tongue. They, they feed off of uh, vegetation. Yeah. 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 Think ants, ants are poisonous, ain't they? Some of them are. Yeah, yeah. 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 We already we thought so, but I was like, I'll yeah. come up with some sure. questions I'll ask. Hey, but ants sure. also are known to uh, break down. They like to break down certain things that die. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's so, so it makes it unclean, like yeah. a bottom feeder. Yeah, yeah. 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 They, they'll uh, they'll what they'll do they um for certain insects say like um uh, grasshopper or worm or something like that die. The ant will take that back to the um, back to the colony mm -hmm. and they'll uh, they'll separate it into into portions. And give it to the, the queen, you know, uh, separate and give it to like the rest of the, the rest of the colonies. So, yeah. But but you you start looking at and even with the the, uh, the, the, uh, the beasts of the field, the, the fowls of the air, the fishes of the sea, yeah. and even down to the creeping things, you start looking at what their purposes are. Uh -huh. You can see where they fall in the ecosystem. And if, and we, if you look at it, the stuff that we can eat is the stuff that directly eats vegetation. Uh -huh. yeah. And that's why Esau is so is such a horrible ruler. Because he takes those those base animals used to, to clean the earth and he puts it on the market for people to eat. That's why everything goes out of order. You know? Well, lambs, shrimps, shark, and that's why they eat it. And the whale well, eats shrimp, eats the krill, and the whole exactly. nine yards, and so on exactly. and so forth. Exactly. 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 Ex
John, John. Uh, first Corinthians chapter 15, <laughs> verse uh, 51. Behold, I show you a mystery. We shall not all sleep, but we shall be all changed. In a moment, in a twinkling of an eye, at the last trump. Hey, could you picture that moment, man? When, when, when all the elect are being morphed. Where you're, like, basically, you just, the moment you, the second you bleep, you're not the same height. Yeah. You, look, you don't feel, you know, you don't, you yeah. just, and you, feel, and you feel totally different. Your mind just changed. Now I feel like you just know everything. You feel clean. Exactly. You know? Clean. All the way. Was it right there? I don't know why I'm thinking like a Superman type of movie. It's something where they got power and, and the guy was like, the, the guy got power, he was like, I feel like he could feel that he had more With power. With the 13 inches? Meteor Man? Was it? Was it oh, Chronicle? Yeah, Chronicle. Yeah, Chronicle. 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 I think it is. Oh, yeah, I think it is. <laughs> Mike, you can try to go around. Power Rangers. They did that Power Rangers. They said that they could feel the power that they had. Yeah. Well, the trumpet shall sound, and the dead shall be raised incorruptible, and we shall be changed. For this corruptible must put on incorruption, and this mortal must put on immortality. So when this meaning never uh, to never die. Yeah. This mortal means to to, to die. Mortal. Even, even even just say that itself we we can barely process it yeah. to never die like that we can't really process that for yeah, it's like, right. especially for an Israelite Israel. Israel. <laughs> Jake yeah. died early no we know it's dead Jake died hella early man you'd be lucky to make it into your 50s or 60s man yeah. you know? extremely blessed to go anything above that every day you live above that man is a blessing in any lifetime, let alone in these last days. Hey, my, my my mother, she had a best friend that you know she grew up with, and what made her stop going around here in her like the last decade or so of her, of her life? Because every time she would go over there and hang out with her friend, she always would uh, 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 hear a, a, a report or news of somebody in the neighborhood dying. You know, all the people that she grew up with over there, everybody dropping dead left and right. The movie Life. Yeah. Anybody got anything else? No, we ain't got nothing else. Yeah, yeah, you, you don't even want to hear it, you know? You want to hear it, that's all up there. Everything in the left. Oh, your, your, your dog got worms. Your mama, her best friend died. Oh, and your mama died, and your sister died too. Marlene? Daddy's sick. <laughs> you see? Like, damn. You said Marlene? No, 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 no. No, no, apparently Marlene. Yeah, Marlene too. <laughs> and then the other sister. Like, damn, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> that, but that's how this life is, though. In which both your your mother and your sister were both killed. Uh -huh. yeah. Anybody want the other? Anybody else got one? Yeah, that's how my grandparents are. You know your, you know your uh, your, your aunt, your aunt, blah blah blah, got diabetes and or yeah. you know your Jake, Jake, your, your Jake, uncle died. Yeah, you know, it was like cancer. Okay, yeah, yeah for them, man. Right? Yeah, cancer, they killed a better place. And then when you say that, they look at you like, how could you, you, so how could you be so, so good? How could you even say that? Because we understand the process. The process is, for Jake that's suffering, that's not his truth, to die is gain. To die is gain. Because you gain, what do you gain? You gain now freedom from this, these chains of darkness. You up there in perfection with the Heavenly Father. Hey, and a lot of people, that, that kills and stress a lot of people out yeah. at the point of uh, uh, that they don't understand uh, the death process. Nope. So it stresses them out. They worry about it. It's uh, Ecclesiastes. Get uh, Sir Rock 40 real fast. Go to Sir Rock 40 real quick. 30? 40. I ain't got nothing. Nope. Verse 1. Great travail is created for every man. And in heavy look and in heavy yoke is upon the sons of Adam. From the day that they go out, that they go out of their mother's womb. 
going into uh, us, uh, uh, Job, Job 14, where it says, uh, 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 man that's born of a woman yeah. is, a, is, is a few days and full of trouble. Yep. And when we come out of our mother's womb, that's the, that's our, that's what we call it our curse day. God, huh? We don't even say birth day, we say our curse day. God. This is, this is the moment we born, we born into hell. And in Job the third chapter, yeah, like, why died I from the beginning? Yeah, why would not still? No, I guess the it just the um health books the uh what is it? Yeah, 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 exhaust. Um but when he goes to that Job the third chapter, he sees the letter, he's like, man, I, I did everything right, bro. How come I didn't die? I'm getting fucked up about it. Same thing in these See, lives. See that that shit right there, that confusion that just went by, that's yeah. death. Yeah. All imagine all of the, the toxins that is uh, released. Yeah. We we die from that shit, man. We're still no, we're right not here, gonna man. allow that shit to. We ain't gonna suffer that shit in our country, man. You know, we're gonna have a clear uh, 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 filtering air system, man. You know, that that type of shit right there is why we die. Except for that smoke that's gonna burn for a thousand years. <laughs> but that's gonna be here in the air. Uh, 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 go ahead, man. Great true, great true bell is created for every man, and in heavy yoke is upon the sons of Adam from the day that they go out of their mother's womb. Yep, catching hell, man. And all you're doing is just working, enslaving, and, 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 and labor just so you can survive and die. Yeah, yeah. that's why it's Solomon, Solomon said yeah. it's all it's, it's vanity and vexation of spirit. Man. It ain't gonna be better. Right. It ain't worth it. it, it this life ain't worth it, man. Hey, hey there's a saying see, that Jake in the world is also living living the best life, living my best life. Yeah. You know? You ain't living the best freaking life, man. You don't know what life is. The death is the best life. <laughs> Trip. There's that uh, what you said, there's a saying in the world is all uh, you're working to live and you living to die. Yeah. You know? That's the cycle of this fucking system, man. Yeah. That's better than the infestation. You need some pain along the way. Yeah. That's yeah. why in the kingdom, yeah, that's that, we're not gonna be vexed. It ain't gonna be vexed. You know, everything is gonna have purpose, man. Go ahead. From the day that they go out, out of the out of their mother's womb, till the day that they return return to the mother of all things. And for us, curse be he that 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 uh that coming out, out yeah, going out. in and, and, and curse be he uh, coming out, man. Hey, because you, 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 you born into curse born, coming in, yeah. and then you die, you usually a grievous death on the way out. <laughs> born in the dead, dying, but you leave your children yeah. dead. Yeah. And you probably lose your You ain't got nothing to leave your children. And, and Jake usually die in pain. Yeah. yeah. Jake usually die in pain. And they always say at the funeral, he, he, he ain't suffering no more. <laughs> Right. Really? Yeah. 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 What we bill he got to pay? Look, look, we told Jake last week. Yeah. Hey, man, your mom's in a better place. He was like, what cause? What, what cause? Hey, man, we trying to give you good news. You over here tripping. We trying to let you know something good. Verse 2. Their imagination of things to come and the day of death. The anticipation. Yeah. It's getting in, into the minds of somebody anticipating or being curious about when their time is going to come. Jake in the hood like that all the time, man. I, mean, I just I just feel, I feel, I feel safe, man. I feel like somebody watching me. And usually those, those Jakes, they, they end up in the situation. They feel that way, but still, man. You know? I mean, this, this, ain't, the, this ain't the life, man. You, you can't even enjoy your kids if you got them, man. You can't enjoy the food. And you'll get sick eating some things that you thought was happy for you, man. You know, that's just how Esau sets everything up. You know? It's vegan food, man. Yeah. God, you, you can't eat too much of that. Mm. You know, because uh, a lot of the foods got uh, soy in it. And that does what? That creates uh, estrogen. Estrogen, yeah. You know? Which is made which with is chemicals. Time, yeah. bro. 
all that flavoring, you know, when they try to make the Beyond Burger and all that, yeah, that, that shit is all chemicals, man. Yeah. <laughs> it's just as deadly as the uh, the actual meat. You probably, might, you, you yeah. might as well eat the Yeah, you probably will, yeah. Go ahead, Al. Their imagination of things to come and the day of death trouble their thoughts. Read that part again. Their imagination of things to come and the day of death trouble their thoughts. The day of, the day of death trouble of their hearts. Yeah. You know? I see death around the corner. <laughs> hey, I thought about that. <laughs> I thought about that. You know? <laughs> Niggas always talk about it. Man. Biggie talking about ready to die. That nigga wasn't ready to die. <laughs> God, yeah. yeah, too much to live for these wicked ass places. That nigga had champagne bottles and crystal bottles to pop open God, and his uh, Gucci sweaters and, and Gucci sweaters to rock. Cheese eggs and roaches and grape. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Yeah, that nigga wasn't eating that shit. He was not looking forward to, 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 to death. But that night, yeah. he got it, man. You know? And that, that, it does trouble them, you know, the, the thought of dying. You know, Jake want to live. They want to live that, live their best life. <laughs> you know, but how could you enjoy it here in the, in the shadow, of, the, the, the land of the shadow of death? That's why we need to be changed. You know, I think there's a little, it might be a little more. I got something. I got two their imagination of things to come and the I day think of still in, uh, still yeah, 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 first yeah. Yeah. If I can pull this before huh. and the day of death trouble their thoughts and cause fear of heart. God. Keep going? Uh yeah, that's that's about that was it. That was, was, was yeah. Alright, let me hit this right quick. Uh, uh, Wisdom of Solomon chapter two. I'm gonna start at the top. For the ungodly said reasoning with themselves, but not a right. Our life is short and tedious, and in the death of a man there is no remedy. Neither was there any man known to have returned from the grave. That's not true now. Now after the hour side, that's not true. We got the victory over death. It says, uh, for we are born at all adventure, and we shall, uh, shall matter of fact, that's, that's why I said uh, uh, reason with himself, but not a right. Because he's not going to die. Right? That was before this. He was translating. You know? It says, uh, anyway, it says. And really, like, when we, when you actually, when, when your flesh do die, you're still uh, being translated. Right. So really, really, like, like the apostles always say, there's really no such thing as death. Yeah. Because your spirit is just making a transition from one realm to another realm. But, but the flesh, his body dies, and that's the problem. That's what most people believe they live at is in their flesh. They still think that they're in their flesh when they die. Yeah. No, you, you, they, they live you in don't in stay in that, that, uh, that abode. Because they're living for their flesh. God. Instead of you, when, when you come into this knowledge, it, it teaches you to live in your spirit, which you know the spirit never dies. You want these bodies. You want these bodies to die. You know? Our bodies grown. Uh, our spirit grown for the things that we go through in body. Anyway, we know it says, um, for we are born at all adventure and shall be hereafter as though we had never been. For the breath in our nostrils has spoke and a little spark in the moving of our heart. It says, uh... Hey, go over from, uh, you still in Sirach 40? Go over to 41. Says, uh, huh? says, which, which being extinguished, our, our body shall be returned to ashes and our spirit shall vanish as the soft air. But no. In Ecclesiastes, we know our spirit go back to the most high of faith. It's Ecclesiastes 12 and 7. Then shall the dust return to the earth as it was, and the spirit shall return unto Yahweh who gave it. Yep. Which is where? In the spiritual realm. Right. The heaven, the heaven of heavens. That's what that's where we all go when we check out of this this uh this death trap. Alright? This body. You know? But as long as we're in this flesh, in this terrestrial flesh. It, 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 it's gonna always, it's because these bodies are meant to just inhabit this yeah. this realm. 
That's why the Lord created a firmament so that we can't go past it. Because yeah. our body's only meant to be right down here. Yeah. We're made of the earth, so it got to go back into the earth. Yeah. But what we can't go if, back. What happens if you die in space? Right. You, you got to come back down. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> you know, you, when you understand the, the big picture, you see the, the falsities that's going on. You, you can actually go into that. That was pretty much the point. Yeah, go ahead, uh, Sarat 41. Sarat chapter 41. Verse 1, O death, how bitter is the remembrance of thee to a man that liveth at rest in his possessions, unto the man that had nothing to vex him. Hey, because the, the ungodly men, the reason why they fear death is because they're afraid of not being able to live, live, not live again. Yeah. And they're wondering, like, well, the riches that I spent this life pouring up all these riches, so... If I die, you know, am I going to have those riches <laughs> wherever I'm going? Can I bring them with me? No, of course not. Dumbass Egyptians tried that. That's why, yeah, the dumbass, uh, uh, the, the goddamn uh, uh, mesmerites, you know, that's why they was uh, getting buried uh, with, with, with gold and stuff, man. You know, mummifying themselves. If they think that they were going to the afterlife, with, 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 the, with those treasures. You know, coming in with rags and shit, I'm coming to the... The whole concept is just stupid. It's a dumbass concept, man. Yeah, man. Ain't none of that, ain't, ain't none of this physical uh, uh, material, that's not in the heavens, man. You know? Everything is, 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 is spiritual up there. Yep. Everything that we see down here is, is, is made up of the elements, man. Oh death, how bitter is the remembrance of thee to a man that liveth at rest in his possessions Go ahead. unto the man that had nothing to vex and that had prosperity in all things. Yeah, unto him that is yet able to receive me. O death, acceptable is thy sentence unto the needy and unto him whose strength fell in, that is now in the last age, and is vexed with all things, and to him that this and to him that despaired and had lost patience. Fear not the sentence of death, remember them that have been before thee, and that come after, for this is the sentence of the Lord over all flesh. That's it. You know? So hey, that's that's the sins over all all, all mankind. Hey, going back to um what Adam what, what Adam did when he followed Eve. From that point on, death came into the world because of what Eve did. You know? What happened? Well the breed that just wants you to kind of dance all those kinds. Well, I ain't got time. I mean, ain't got time for that. <laughs> Hey, boys, grow up, man. Grow up. Just grow up. I'm just leave it at that. Grow up. Just go ahead and keep teaching. Yeah, bro, that, that was all I wanted, you know? Because the scripture said, you know, when you come of age, you vex with all type of things, you vex with all type of ailments, sicknesses, all type of worries, and all you, all that's happened is your body is further, further breaking down. With, with each day, as you age, your body is deteriorating, you know? So really, death is, is is actually a good thing, man. Hey, you get to hit the reset, reset button. Now it's fucked up. You don't get to retain the information. Right. But hey, at least you get another chance. Can you imagine living more than 100 and 200 years in this place? Hey, the movie God in time. Damn, man. The movie in time. Y'all remember that Justin Timberlake movie in yeah, time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, he was 105 years old. He was like, man, I'm ready to go. Uh, yeah. It's just, and I got a, I got a century. I got 11 million years on my arm. I'm ready to get up out of here, though. Yeah. I'm 25 years old, but I'm, my spirit is through. I wouldn't want to live. No. <laughs> no. I ain't trying to live no. 50 years. Not, no. not, not like this. Not like, no, not like now this shit. Of heaven. Yeah. I don't want to raise grandchildren in this oh. shit. Right. You know? Yeah. Like, the most I didn't bring us into this truth for us to right. grow old. Right. You know? For hey, we. Kurt. 
Go ahead. Nah, because the scriptures tell you he's, he's speeding up the date for the elect's sake, man. Which means what? Yahweh Shah, Yahweh and Yahweh Shah, they want this shit to be over, man. Yahweh Shah can't wait to get back so he can, so he can uh, plead with all flesh, man. You know? Yeah, man. And what did it say? Uh, 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 Moses uh, uh, planted. Uh, I forgot exactly, but, but uh, Apollo's water, I forgot. And most I get increase. And most I get increase. Everybody had the level of time that came into the truth from, from the apostles, elders, that taught them, starting with uh, Elder Albert uh, you know, Elder Albert, Albert Goodness, all the way down. They did their time in this, and now they got to move on to the next stage. And their works follow them, man. And their works follow them. Because the scriptures say that then Yahweh Shai shall arise first. You know? Let's go, he brings it back to what you see we're talking about. First uh, Corinthians uh, 15 and 54. So when this corruptible shall have put on incorruption, and this mortal shall have put on immortality, this shall be brought to pass the saying that is written, death is swallowed up in victory. O death, where is thy sting? O grave, where is thy victory? He's quoting Isaiah right there. Isaiah prophesied about that. And we're going to get the, uh, the victory over death, man. And how is uh, death going to be uh, 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 abolished? Because Yahweh Shai already defeated death. He, de he defeated death for us. So that's why when he when he shows up this time, there's going to be those that, that's uh, that's not going to taste of death. Yeah. He's yeah. about to say that, right? Well, not, not in this chapter, but, you know, Yahweh Shai says it. But how hey, but how did death uh, uh, come upon us? Yeah. Through sin? Yeah. So so how are we not gonna die? By the Lord changing us and programming us not to sin. Get the uh, the new covenant. Right the sting the sting of death is sin. And the strength of sin is the law. There, there we the go. The strength of sin. There we go. That's a cold way to say it. The transgression of, of the law. Yeah. When we, when we, uh, I believe it's in, uh, uh, is it Romans eight? But it's talking about, um, I think so, something around there. It's talking about uh, our knowledge of the law is what is what uh, brought forth more sin upon us. Because with the more we knew about it the more Jake would try to find a way to weasel around it. And instead of just fulfilling it. But we weren't, we weren't created to, to, uh, to fulfill it 100%. Which, if you, you break one, you broke them all. So that was, that was a tough thing. So that, that right there is, is a powerful way to, to see uh, how it was working. So to give us the victory over that, but also keep us fulfilling the law. You gotta get that in the eight chapter. Okay. It was eight, it was that, uh, six. six. But seven. now at the obtained, it's a lot. I said, is it seven? Hebrews eight and six. Eight. Uh, but now hath he obtained a more excellent ministry, but how much also he is the mediator of a better covenant, which was established upon better promises. So the old covenant, basically the, uh, the, 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 to keep the law, you have to keep it 100%. Now that was a beautiful covenant if we could have kept it 100%. But the fact that we couldn't keep it 100, was gonna say we couldn't keep it 100 percent because finding the fault was them, yeah, the fault was in us nice. that we couldn't keep it. Okay. Matter it was, fact, the law was contrary to us. Right. You know, it was but, contrary but it, but to our But the intention nation. was was yeah. right though. Yeah. That's why it, it does. It's not disannulled. Yeah. Go ahead, right? For if the first covenant had been faultless, uh -huh. then should no place have been sought for the second. Right. But but like I said, you can't say that they, they threw the old. Law, uh, uh, covenant out. The, the, the fault was in us. And, uh, and, oh, my bad. I want to uh, make a point about that uh, better covenant established on better promises. The fact that it's written in us that, that we don't have a choice to make about it. This is going to naturally be the righteous thing that we're just going to do inherently. Just what we're going to naturally do is the right thing every time. That's me. I, I, you know, we understand the trial that we go through, but you sit back like, man, why? Somebody asked me that dumb question. Why didn't he do the most high just, just do that in the first place? Because we wouldn't have understood the full process of this thing. 
plus, we don't got to do it that way. He wanted us to see the whole big picture. So, so now we understand how to judge properly in the, in the proper measure. You don't, you don't kill somebody uh, for, the, for the wages of, uh, of stealing, like a klepto, if, if they were stealing to feed themselves. That's a different judgment for that. Mm -hmm. You've got to be able to know how to judge that differently, even though they're both stealing. Okay, so that process is what, what, what taught us this. Go ahead, I'm huh? with them. He says, Behold, the day is come, except the Lord, without making a new covenant with the house of Israel, uh -huh. or with the house of Judah. And the apostle always stops right there. He didn't say with the whole world. He said, With Israel and the house of Judah, only the Israelites. You always got to make that point right there. And the nations, they can't be joined into yep. the covenant. Yep. All right? If you had that fool, uh, uh, G Con, this motherfucker was saying that uh, the heathens can do it. If they, if, if, if the heathens marry an Israelite, that's that's their way of uh, they can join the, uh, the covenant. Yeah. And, and uh, that dude, uh, uh, Haka, Deacon Haka, he was like, so basically what you're saying is, for a heathen woman to be a partaker of the covenant, she got to get dicked down to right, be a right. part of the Lord's covenant, man. Yeah. Think of how foolish that's. That don't even sound right. What? How does she earn it? You know, you can't. It don't change anything. But they're not but, a part of the covenant, and, and, it's, and it's never been that way. Now I want to say this though: the heathen will live better by living by the covenant, by living by the laws. Of, I don't want to say the covenant, but by living by the laws of the Bible, they're gonna live better. But but the covenant doesn't belong to them. It doesn't have nothing to do with the covenant itself. That's why they had, while we had it written in us. You know, that's how you know we're we're gonna. They gotta uh, practice. That's how you know we're gonna be priests to them, and also, if we're gonna be priests, you know, a kingdom of priests and, and, and judges. Yep. But also, we're not gonna die, but they will still be dying. Mm -hmm. Right. <laughs> you know. That's the separation. That lets you know that this this covenant is only for Israel. God. Uh, protect, basically pursuant to this covenant, we're gonna live. <laughs> yeah, for real. The Lord's gonna program us so that we don't die again. Because the wages of sin is death. So go ahead, huh? Nah, not according to the covenant that I made with their fathers in the day when I took them by the hand. And it sounds like, and that's why that's, that's why I love the way the Bible written is meant to trip people up. Not according to the, the, uh, the covenant I made with the fathers, because the covenant he made with the forefathers was about what? That we had to perform it. But what he's going to do when he writes it in us, we're going to perform it perfectly. Okay? Like, like the apostle said uh, yesterday, we won't, we won't be in need for uh, for sacrifices because we're not going to go off. So, basically. No? Yeah. Uh, Continue. Uh, he didn't go back to uh, sacrifice. And no, they're not going to sacrifice. There ain't going to be no more animal sacrifices. Uh, animals the getting done like that, man, because so y'all can't get it right. Mm -hmm. They just going they just going we going to go through the proper uh, uh judgments. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Whatever uh, uh yeah, they, 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 they catch break. it. Yeah, they just going to catch it. No. Yep. Damn, I didn't think about it like that, but yeah. Makes sense. Yeah. No rain. Yeah. The most high. Yeah. Yeah. Like, the scripture saying, if they don't yeah. come and keep the yeah. feet to tabernacle, <laughs> we ain't going to la allow you to uh, grow your food. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's why you can <laughs> place yeah. whatever hell you yeah. want on it. Yeah. Hey, that's going to be good and fitting punishment for them for all the shit that they put us through. It's going to be this righteous life. judgment. God. Yeah. Righteous right judgment. There. Play. They don't get a second chance. We got yeah. the second chance because we were the children of the most high. The judgment will be handled speedily. Yeah. Yeah. It won't be. You know, you sit in the no, cell no. to wait till your trial. Give you a moment to, no. to no. repent. No. Give you, give you a little time to repent and figure it out. Nah, Jake already right, took that to the max and went further more wicked with that time period mm -hmm. that they should be repenting. Go ahead, bro. Continuing nine, because they continue not in my covenant.